Hello students, in the previous video lesson we have discussed about combination and decomposition reaction. Now here we are going to learn another next type of reaction. Now before starting with that type of reaction, let's talk about one activity. This activity is showing about the next type of reaction. Let's see what is that. In a test tube, we are going to take copper sulfate solution. If you remember, the color of copper sulfate solution is blue. In this test tube, we are going to suspend iron nail with the help of a thread. Now, you will observe in this test tube, after some time, the color of copper sulfate, which is blue, changes to green. Now, here, what is happening in this test tube, due to which the color is changing to green, this is the new type of reaction which is known as displacement reaction. Now what is happening in this reaction, displacement reaction? Iron metal is displacing copper and forming iron sulphate. The color was earlier blue which was of copper sulphate. The new substance which is formed is iron sulphate which is now green in color. Now, why this is taking place, the color change is taking place in the reaction? This is due to iron is more reactive than copper as you can see in the reactivity series. We have a reactivity series of metals. Here, this reactivity series you can see, potassium is kept at the top and at the bottom is gold. Potassium is the most reactive metal, gold is the least reactive metal. And here we can compare all the metal which is the most reactive, which is the less reactive. For example, if you see iron is more reactive than copper, magnesium is more reactive than iron, aluminium is more reactive than copper. So we can compare and we can find out which metal can displace the other metal. But the reaction takes place between a metal and another should be a metal salt solution. If suppose I write copper plus FeSO4, the reaction is not possible. What is the reason? Copper is less reactive than iron, so it will not displace iron. But instead, iron can displace copper from copper sulfate solution. So what does it mean? In a displacement reaction, more reactive metal displaces the less reactive metal from its salt solution. I hope this is clear to everyone that there is the characteristic property of this reaction that color change takes place during this reaction. Now we will discuss another one more activity but you will come to know about another type of reaction from that activity. Suppose we take a test tube. In this test tube we are taking a salt solution which is called sodium sulfate. This is a colorless aqueous solution. Now in this salt solution we are adding using a test tube another solution barium chloride. This is also a colorless aqueous solution. Now, when we add to it we will find out the reaction takes place and a white substance settles down at the bottom. Now what is that white substance? That white substance which is a new substance which is formed is barium sulfate. BASO4. This barium sulfate is settled down at the bottom of test tube and we call it as a precipitate. So this precipitate is also one of the characteristic of the next type of reaction which is known as double displacement reaction. After displacement we are going to learn double displacement reaction. Here we have in this reaction two salt solution reacting together, ion exchange taking place and two new substances are formed where we can even get a precipitate. So sometimes double displacement also show precipitation reaction. So Let's see what was the reaction in this activity. Sodium sulfate aqueous solution plus barium chloride aqueous solution. When the reaction takes place, we get 
बेरियम सल्फेट एंड सोडियम क्लोराइड एक्वा सोल्यूशन इफ यू रिमेम्बर दिस डाउनवर्ड एरो दिस इंडिकेट द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ प्रेसिपिटेट द कलर ऑफ प्रेसिपिटेट विच इज फॉर्म हियर इज वाइट सो दिस इज वन ऑफ द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ डबल डिस्प्लेसमेंट रिएक्शन दैट प्रेसिपिटेट इज ऑल्सो फॉर्म ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन समटाइम्स लाइक फॉर द रिएक्शन एच सी एल प्लस एन एओ एच वी गेट एन ए सी एल प्लस एच टू ओ एच सी एल एक्वा सोल्यूशन एन एओ एच इज ऑल्सो एक्वा सोल्यूशन एन ए सी एल एक्वा सोल्यूशन एंड वॉटर नाउ हियर ऑल आर एक्वा सोल्यूशन नो प्रेसिपिटेट इज ऑप्टेन बट दिस इज ऑल्सो डबल डिस्प्लेसमेंट रिएक्शन इट मीन्स वेन एवर आयन एक्सचेंज टेक्स प्लेस the elements they are exchanging their places here sodium has changed taken the place of barium and barium has taken the place of sodium hydrogen has taken the place of sodium sodium has taken the place of hydrogen so here ion exchange is taking place so this reaction is known as double displacement reaction so but no precipitate is formed in this second reaction this reaction is taking place between acid and a base so since it is forming a salt without any precipitation but it is a double displacement reaction we call it as neutralization reaction since it is taking place between acid and a base and forming a neutral substance which is a salt with water although ion exchange is taking place so what is the uh, definition of double displacement reaction the reaction in which exchange of ion takes place between two salt solution to form either a precipitate or any sub another type of substance we call it as double displacement reaction here for example if the precipitate is formed we call it as precipitation reaction if the reaction is taking place between acid and base we call it as neutralization reaction this one activity another one uh, one more example of double displacement reaction let's see silver nitrate aglo3 aqua solution plus nacl aqua solution both are colorless when the reaction takes place again ion exchange is taking place silver is taking the place of sodium sodium is taking the place of silver now what will be the new substance form sodium is taking the place of silver so we'll get na no 3 plus ag cl here the precipitate will form is of silver chloride this precipitate is also white remember this activity is also there you can get the questions based on observation what happens when silver nitrate solution is added to sodium chloride solution so what will be your observation a white precipitate is formed what is this type of reaction we can say either it is a type of it is precipitation reaction or you can say double displacement reaction main type of reaction is double displacement reaction characteristic is precipitation reaction i hope this is clear to everyone so today we have learned displacement reaction and double displacement reaction thank you